All right, let's uh, take a look at Democracy Gauge now as we wrap up our news headlines. Today's gauge is produced outside of our borders. We look at the role of neighboring country Lesotho and what it has played in South Africa's road to liberation. The geographical position of Lesotho made it a valuable and strategic partner in fighting apartheid. Lesotho's independence also made it possible for most comrades fleeing the country to seek a home in Lesotho. The language, the culture and proximity made it possible for a natural blend-in. The pious, the 12th university, became to many a melting pot for many young, broad African political minds and a true seed for liberation against the harsh apartheid regime. Rapaleng Radebe has the story. Well, my name is Kolo Rangulupani. Dibizo. I was born in Soweto, in a township called uh, Dube. And my parents, especially my mom, uh, is from Malizuku, uh, from a village called Haramati. That's where she was born. So my relationship with Lesotho, it's, it's very close, close and touching because I had parents staying here, born here, and also the other parent, my father, born in South Africa. You know, Lesotho played a very important role in the politics of South Africa. Not only of South Africa. I mean, I was at a national university and I would meet quite a number of other guys from uh, Namibia, Zimbabwe, Mozambique. They were catered here for, by the government of, South, of, of, of Lesotho. South Africans were much more taken care of during the Telebua Jonathan's era. Let me tell you, we stayed with them. Let me tell you, they went to school without paying a cent for school fees. You know, they, they were at home. They, they, they were like, they were not refugees, you know. We met everywhere. We went to discourse with them. We, went, we socialized with them. You look at uh, a number of other people who are already holding very crucial positions in South Africa. Take, for instance, the Minister of Finance. He was a student here. Talk about the former uh, uh, vice, uh, vice president, Tuntatembeki, anyway. Younger, yeah, exactly. All, all, of the, all, all these crucial guys who are holding very powerful positions in South Africa are guys who came and got education here in Lesotho. Well, you know, politics, it's a, it's a game which uh, countries play. Since Lesotho or other neighboring countries to South Africa uh, played a certain role, we expect to see South Africa uh, paying back to Lesotho or other countries like Botswana. Or, but it doesn't work that way. You know, once you have got your independence, there, there are lots and lots of things which you have to take care of. What we need to do is to learn what it is which we can gain from South Africa.